All right, it's Mark Delise, and I have a really powerful little software that I had developed. This thing has so many practical uses for the internet marketer. If you have a list and you're emailing your list, no question about it that this will skyrocket your click-through rates when people are reading your emails. What it does, it, it takes a video, it could be a YouTube video or a video from your hard drive, and it converts that video to a GIF. Also, it keeps the player controls as optional you can have a play icon as optional and it does a lot of really cool stuff I'll show you exactly how it works first of all this is the application right here video to gif and you have two options here you can select a local file from your hard drive file folder so I can just select this mp4 video right here and when I do that obviously this video is loaded inside the software here's the video right here and you have the option you can spread this out if you want you have the option to keep the control bar on or off. So for example, if you just want a, a GIF image, you just deselect that and it'll turn it right into a nice GIF image uh, from your video. If you want to retain the controls, you can do that. Also, you can see here that you can minimize the, you can convert it from a, right now the original file, the original dimension is 854 by 480, but you can say, I want to cut that in half. Now it's going to be 426 by 240. So the image is going to be this size right here. Uh, here is the play button time. What's going to do is going to create a play button uh, right in the middle at the very start and you can delay it by how many seconds you want or you can disable it right now. You can disable it or you can, I'm going to have one second so after one second it's going to start playing. The image is going to play. <laughs> really, really cool. Here you can set the frame rate. So the original frame rate is 25 frames per second. Obviously that's going to be a higher image size so I'm gonna put it to eight frames per second I'm gonna have the player controls the skin on that's gonna be on and here you can set the compression method for best compression it's gonna be automatic you just, just select best compression and the image size is not gonna be so large or you can have or you can have best quality this is here the quality of the image is gonna be very sharp but the image size is gonna be larger or you can go to variable and you can tinker around with your own. I, I probably would not recommend this unless you know what you're doing. I usually do the best compression. After you're done, you simply click on export. And this is going to come up. And you can save the file. So I've done 12 of them already. I'm going to save this one called 13. All right. So it's going to be 13. And you can see now it's going to do the entire thing. Now that's a pretty big image so it's going to go from zero seconds all the way to three minutes and 33 seconds and it's going to do it really fast now i don't want an image that long all right that's going to go through the entire thing so what i can do i can uh, come back and i can play around where it says time range to export it's from zero to 213 seconds so i'm going to start the i'm going to start the image say uh, around right here and i'm going to end the image see how this works so it's going to be it's going to start at 24 seconds and it's going to end at about at 35 seconds so it's going to be about 10 seconds long all right now i can export it once again and i'm going to say, call this one image 14 and i'm going to save it now it's really fast you see that i can open up the folder and i'm going to show you both of them this is the first one that i did this is the longer one i'm going to open with the firefox browser and here it is right here. After one second, it's actually going to start. And you can see it's going to play the entire thing. So four or five. You see the little second thing changing there? So I don't want to do that. I'm going to uh, do the other one. Here is the other one I'm going to show you. This one's only got about 10 seconds on it. I'm going to open with Firefox. And now this is going to be 10 seconds long. It's actually 11 seconds. See how it's going to play? So what you can do, you can set this up inside your email and you, you make it clickable so when when people go and they read your email their email they see this video it has a play icon at the very start let me refresh that for you look at the very start it has a play icon and then it starts playing i can actually delay it but people will see a video and they'll click on there you can make a click you can make it a clickable image inside your email and it'll go right to whatever landing page that you want it to very very powerful now what's even sweeter is that you can take this software there and you can also select any YouTube URL. You see that? So I'm going to go open up my browser here and I'm going to go to this uh, Red Bull and I'm going to put this URL. It's a really cool video. I like it. And I'm going to take this URL right here. 
I'm going to open up the software once again, and I'm going to put that URL right in there. Now you click on list streams, and it's going to grab all the different streams that's available for this video. Now on this YouTube video here, I have set the dimensions uh, to be 640 by 360. I've, you can set anything manually that you want, or you can click on this little uh, drop down box here to minimize it. The frame rate is going to be 8, and I'm going to change the timeline to be um, probably about start to go right there, and I'm going to end the image. Uh, it's going to be about, let's just start or end it right, right there, okay? And the play button is going to be four seconds long, and it's going to be best compression, and I'm going to click on export, and I'm going to set the to number 16, and I'm going to click on save. All right. So now it is finished. So I'm going to click on uh, open folder. And I'm going to show you this. I'm going to open with Firefox right here. And there's the image right there. And it's going to be delayed by uh, four seconds. And it's going to start. Isn't that really cool? Show that airplane from the Red Bull commercial. And now I can obviously open up my Gmail account. And I can send this. So for example, here is my Gmail account. And I'm going to send a one to Mark Delise videos. It's another Gmail, and I'm going to, subject's going to be test, and I can put some text right there, test, and then I'm going to scroll down, and I'm going to come down below, right here, I'm going to click on photo, insert photo, and I'm going to upload, and I can open up the folder and drag it to right there, okay, and it's going to, it's uploading it now to my Gmail. All right, so there it is, and it's going to insert it, and I'm going to click on there. And now I'm going to uh, click on the insert URL, and I'm going to change it. And now it's going to be, well, let's just put, for example, Mark Lee's blog, all right? And click OK. Now I'm going to click on send, and that email will be right here. There it is, test. Let me just open that up. It's going to have the play icon. It's going to start after four seconds. So people will click on that. They'll think it's a video and they'll click on it. And when they go to click on it, you'll see that you want to bring them to the landing page that actually has that video. So it's very, very powerful. It'll increase your conversion rates for your click through rates on your emails, but also people put these on their websites. And so if you see a sales page, they have GIF images. It might be a little product demo. It's not a video, but it's a GIF image and it could have a uh, the player controls or not have the player controls. They usually do not, but mine has the options. So there's the, the little software. It does incredible things. And this is great for the internet marketer for uh, putting GIF images on your sites, on your sales pages, on your blogs, uh, but also inside your emails to increase your click-through rates on your emails so that you can get more money and more traffic to your sites through email marketing. Thank you.